Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another video. Okay, so this is the robot dog. It's a bit more assembled than it was last time. So you can see this time we've got the head part and the back part. So I've also put the APC220 in the back, so we've got the aerial coming out like a tail. Um, I've taken off any screens and stuff. So I don't think it's the right place for them. Right, uh, on the front, instead of having the sonar sensors, we've got something that's a lot like a parking sensor on a car. So, I mean, I mean, it doesn't have to be waterproof, but I thought it looked a bit cleaner. Just having a flat on there, it's got a few meters range, so it should be quite good. Right, um, so yeah, it's all assembled inside. It's all made out of these little flat sections that slide along, slide along a piece of threaded bar. So we've got the bottom bits of threaded bar, you can't see, because it's all hidden up pretty well. But then you've got two more bits that's gonna be coming in. I just haven't put them on yet. And then for the back, I got this cover here. That's printed out quite nice. And I've just stuck some magnets on there. So once I've got the two threaded bars going across, this will just clip straight on. Right, so yeah, same wiring as before. Well, same uh, internal components. So I2C server controller, Arduino Mega. And then underneath you can see the battery pack. So that fits in there quite nice. But the cable took up a bit more space than I thought, so I'm going to have to make some kind of lid with a lump on it that will go in there. Okay, so I've been doing a little bit of programming and I've got a sort of walking thing kind of roughly set up. But it's only on two legs at the moment, so I'll just show you that now. So I'm not quite sure if it's going to work or not. But what I'm going to do is try and get all four legs like this and then just put it on the floor and see what happens. So, yeah, they're not going to do that. I mean, I've had to tighten up some of these gears a little bit, because they, uh, I mean, they, they weren't quite great. Because I've only really got one bearing in here. And there is a slight little bit of play. But I've managed to space out and wash this and do it on really tight with the long bolts. So it's fairly solid now. Right, okay, so that's it for this part. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to like. If you want to see more, don't forget to subscribe. Right, thanks for watching.